It's the moment you've all been waiting for, our top five plays of the week, carefully curated by producer Jason Ozenbaugh. Coming in at number five, we go to the gridiron. Toledo Thunder's Ray Parker puts his shoulder down, running through a defender. This gets us excited for football season. And off. There you go again with Parker. Just go. The, the, the glide, man, but he still yeah, no, he's, he's got his got shoulder and arrives with a boom, too. At number four, to the ballpark, Mudhens and the Indians both fighting for first place in the IL West. Ninth inning, hens down one. Jason Krizan with bases loaded, finds a gap in the outfield and drives in three ones, gives Toledo the lead, and they'll stay atop the IL West. He pitches. Swung on, fly ball, left center field. Can anybody get there? No, it's in the gap. That's going to split the outfielders. Two runs score. Here comes a third, and he'll score as well. And the Mudhens take the lead. Number three, back to the Toledo Thunder, thrown to the corner of the end zone. Ernest Winters with the grab, both feet stay in. That's good enough for number three. Rivalry here. Into the end zone, caught. Is he inbounds this time? Yes, touchdown. At number two, hence Chad Hoffman in the Triple A home run derby down in Columbus. Cracked this one into left field stands. He's the only triple A player to win the home run derby twice with 10 home runs. An incredible feat. He brought that belt back to Toledo. And coming in at number one, we take you back to Highland Meadows. Marathon Classic final round down to the final cut in sudden death. Tita Fush Wanapora. She'll get a hug from her caddy and Brittany Lincecum, her first LPGA Tour victory.